Hello everyone. In this video, I'll be talking about events integration. We will cover various aspects of event integration with an SAP system. Let's now talk about when do we use events. Events are used when you want to integrate SAP with an event broker. For example, events can be used to integrate with SAP Event Mesh or SAP Business Technology Platform. Events are mainly used for Internet of Things application integration. To handle events, it is preferable to implement loosely coupled integration. When you want to implement loosely coupled integration, it is always preferable to use PubSub model, stands for Publish and Subscribe model. They work asynchronously and can handle huge volumes of data. In the background, events uses MQTT protocol. MQTT stands for Message Queuing Telemetry Transport which is a lightweight messaging protocol based on published subscribe infrastructure. This is the backbone of events integration. SAP offers events API to implement MQTT client. We can use this API to integrate with an event broker. This API provides handler methods like onConnect, onMessage and onSubscribe to interact with an event broker, in SAP, MQTT supports WebSockets and TCP sockets to push the message to an event broker. ABAP MQTT client is available on ABAP platform 18.09 and above. Hope you got the basics of events in SAP. Let's now have a quick recap quiz. Which type of communication does events support? What type of integration technique that you would use for IoT applications? What protocol does events use internally? Let me know your answers in the comment section. Thank you for watching.